Okay, so this is just a little review of the little Kingston Mini Battery Pack Charger, whatever you want to call it. So it's basically a tiny, tiny charger. It's a charger. There's iPod Touch. Here's the charger. Charger's a little thicker than the touch. And take off the cover. It's got the little iPod dock connector. And I got this because I left my iPod out on the porch, so now the battery is shorted out and it doesn't hold a charge at all. So I use this a lot. So I'll just take it out and plug it in. This guy looks exactly like it's charging. A little battery sign down there. It's, there's, if you look, you can see there's three dots, there's two dots, and there's one dot. Three dots is 100%, two is 60, and one dot is 20 or less. And it may, just makes it like about two inches longer. I don't care. There's one con about it, one bad thing. This is only for iPod Touch. If you have an iPhone, this it doesn't matter. That it'll block the headphone port. Headphone ports right there. You could mod some headphones, take off the casing, and then make them really thin, and you might be able to get them to fit through there. But other than that, you're out of luck. You could buy an extender cable. I'm probably just gonna leave it like this. But, um, sorry, okay, I'm plug it back in. Here's just a little, basically, it ha this is two in one. It's a top for it, so it sticks on the top. Or, you can put it on the side, and it's a little stand. And that, so, um, then here's the cool part. Here's the charging cable right here. Um, charging cable. It's like it's this little thing. And it's retractable. So you go like this. You pull it. You got your basic standard mini USB on one end. Standard USB on the other end. And then right there is the where it plugs in. Plug this in. Okay, so just pops right in there. And I'll take my iPad down. Eyesight or whatever. And I will pull it out here. Okay, so my Mac. Um then here's a here's my laptop down here. Vista, um, and I will take this. I'll just plug it in into a spare USB port right here, and that's all. Now I'm here. There's the battery level, and there's a charging light. But then you can also pull out my little charger here. You can also plug it into a standard iPod charger. So that's pretty cool. Let's back on top of my Mac. So that's basically it. And so that's it works pretty well. I haven't used it for a long time, but I'll say I haven't I've only charged it once and I've used it yesterday and today and it hasn't gone down a lot. It's at 100% right now. I don't know if you can see that, but it is. So, battery life is pretty nice. Okay. Okay. And... Okay. Okay. Don't have a shorted out iPod like this one. You can use it to extend your battery life a little longer. So, yeah. That's pretty much it.
Um, this is a review of the Kingston Mini Battery Charger for iPod and iPhone. See ya. There's how dead my iPod is. Just restarted itself when it was plugged in. And just so I, I do have 3.0 on here. Um, this is a 3.0 iPod. Yeah. Okay, we've all seen the fat goes blank on 3.0. I don't know why. Yeah. yeah. Look up there, the battery. It's at this charger, but. Okay, see ya.